Next, we're climbing all these stairs to get to the Achi Shrine. This is already a beautiful view from the stairs of the temple. So we climbed all the many stairs to the Achi Shrine. Actually, I thought it was a castle, but it turns out it's a shrine with many stairs. See here you have the system to rinse your mouth and wash your hands before entering the shrine. Very peace, beautiful, peaceful with a view over the town of Kurashiki. So we can see the Chinese horoscope here and the ceiling of this beautiful building with a view such a nice view over the city of Kurashiki Often Japanese shrines have this type of decoration made of paper and it symbolizes the lightning because after lightning the production of rice will increase so it's a good meaning so this is uh, the shrine is related to the imperial family and so it has this rope maybe you people saw similar one at Ise Beautiful and look at the tree how interesting design it is and then this tunnel here with the last sunset light on the cherry blossom kept walking up here thinking it's a dead end but although the temple is closed we can see this beautiful wood and there are streets continuing so it's so romantic Japanese classical traditional Next, let's see the view from Achi Shrine on top of all these stairs, on top of entire Kurashiki. We even get to see the sunset over Kurashiki. Here where the temples are, all these traditional buildings. Oh yes, this is nice, the beautiful angle. And we are here on the top of the grave mountain. See, probably each enclosure belongs to one family. And these are so expensive and we have a nice view with the sunset over the city of Kurashiki. Because in Japan, the graveyards are, if possible, on the hill to have a nice view and sunlight, I suppose. So, wow, this is so, I suppose, interesting. All these graves on such a layered, you know, mountain. And then the living world out there with the Shinkansen sound, the trains bustling while they here are gone. 